guys, so today I'm going to be doing the Santa's tag, and I got this tag from Glam Life Guru on YouTube, and I saw her video, and I thought it looked like a lot of fun. So, I'm going to be doing it today. So if you didn't know, all the, the questions or different things you have to answer for the video spell out Santa's tag, like, what's that poem called? I want to call it a haiku. Some kind of poem that we learned in elementary school where S is show us your favorite holiday pajamas and my favorite holiday pajamas is this onesie because I don't really wear pajamas but when I get really cold and I feel like I need extra warmth when I sleep I put this onesie on and I got it from Target and it was like $20 I think, it wasn't that expensive. I don't know if that's expensive for a onesie, but let me zip this up. And it's, I don't know if this is really holiday-y, but it's red, and which reminds me of Christmas. There's just this red onesie, and it has a little fox on it. Like, look at how cute the little fox is. And, yeah, it's just a onesie. It goes all the way down. And the best part about these, the feet are also little foxes. And it's just the cutest little thing ever. So the next question is a smell that reminds you of winter and mine would have to be pine trees because my tree, I don't really exactly know if it's a pine tree, but it's just like the tree smell. Like you know what I'm talking about, the smell that trees have because of our Christmas tree, because we get real ones every year. Yeah, that's just my favorite smell and it reminds me of Christmas. And that was the A and the first one was the S. So. S A and then it goes N T A S T A G like Santa's tag. Yeah, get it? And the next is number one item on your Christmas list this year. And I answer this in my Winterlicious tag, but the number one item on my Christmas list is meet and greet passes to One Direction. And it seems how the things are going right now that I'm not going to be able to get those. So if I don't be able to, if I'm not gonna be able to get those tickets, I want to get my tragus pierced and my doubles. Because I have my first hole and my cartilage and that kind of looks weird so I want to get my doubles and my tragus. Yeah! And T is tell us the best gift that you've ever received or given and the best gift that I have ever received is this baby right here. Her name is Ginger and that's why her name is Ginger because we got her on the holidays and she's a Yorkie. <laughs> and for 7th grade Christmas I got her for my Christmas present and we've gone three years hardcore strong and I love her. She just woke up from a nap, so she's really tired. Fun fact, if you watched all my videos, you've seen all my dogs. I have three dogs, Belle, Ginger, and Holly. Holly was in my last video, and Belle was in one of my episodes of the week, and that's Ginger. Yep. The best gift that I've ever given would have to be just like love in general, because giving people gifts, it's not the same meaning as giving someone love. I mean, you obviously give them a gift, but the more time and effort you put into give their gift, it just means a lot more, and that's what I think is really special for when I give someone a gift, I make it sentimental to them. And A is angel or star at the top of your tree, and every year we put an angel, but some years we actually put a Santa Claus on the top of our tree, which I don't know if anyone else does that, but we do that, but this year it's gonna be an angel. And it's the prettiest angel. S is share an old picture of you from Christmas. I don't have any old pictures of me from Christmas because all of the old pictures that we had from my family, they are on my brother's computer and my brother's at college. So I'm sorry. I could try to look for one. I mean, I could try. This is the big book of old pictures of Sarah. <laughs> see if there's any Christmas ones. Pretty sure they're all birthdays. And stuff ballet of North. The closest thing I could find was this picture and it's a picture from Thanksgiving not Christmas so I guess this counts but it's just me. That's how I used to look when I was little with um a bunch of dogs from up north. I was so little, and the dolls are so big, and now it's the other way around. And the T is treasure traditions. What are mine? My treasure traditions are being broken this year, but 
Every other year we have Christmas at my house and my grandparents come down, but they're getting really old so they couldn't do that this year and we're also going to Florida. Um, and they come down and we open presents on Christmas morning and we have a big family breakfast and then we go out and see a movie on Christmas Day and then on Christmas night that dinner we go to my other grandpa's house and have dinner at his house and open presents there and also every year we go the week before Christmas or 10 days this year we're going 10 days before Christmas we go up to my grandparents house and we have our whole family well my whole dad's side of the family over and we just celebrate uh before Christmas kind of Christmas we play one elephant we give gifts we have big dinner it's really fun so we're doing that this Saturday actually and the next A is a beauty product that you can't live without this cr during Christmas season and it's just any kind of red lipstick this is the only red lipstick I have right now and it's this Revlon just bitten kissable balm stain one and it's in the color Adore and I just love red lips on Christmas I think I'm gonna wear this to the family party that I said this Saturday because I just love red lips yeah. why not put it on right now you know why why not <laughs> and the next and last question is greatest Christmas dessert that you've had and that's G I really like lately I've loved um, butter pecan, like ice cream. I don't know why, I've just been obsessed with that lately. But I'd have to say the best dessert that I've ever had for Christmas was one year my grandma made a trifle, and that was literally the best thing that I've had. And also, I just love pumpkin pie, apple pie, any kind of pie. I'm just like a dessert freak. Like, I did eat so many desserts, but the trifle would have to be my favorite. So that's a tag. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. And I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys. Number one item on your Christmas list is Christmas. Christmas. What? Pat on the back, Sarah. And T, I mean, and the T is best gift you ever, you've been ever given. Or, wait. <laughs> Shake my head. <laughs>